So with this being the 4th of July, I figured I'd show you a little inexpensive and cheap firework for some of you. And it's merely just lighting up a piece of steel wool like this. What you do is you simply take your ordinary wrapping of steel wool that you can buy at any hardware store. And after you get it out of the package, you need to fluff it up a bit, which I'm going to do now. What we want to do is we want to fluff it up because we want to get air in between all these steel voids where the uh, iron is. Get it down here. Make sure I can get a nice good view of that. Good view. And all we gotta do is simply light it on fire. You can simply do it with an ordinary lighter. And as you can see, it's burning through the steel wool. Now what's happening is the air is providing oxygen to the flames in the steel wool. And the, the steel wool is made of iron, and the two together create iron oxide. Now again, the reason I say you need to fluff it up is because you need to be able to have a self-sustaining combustion reaction throughout the steel wool. Now this is during the daytime, but this would be a lot more interesting to look at at nighttime. It's a very interesting little thing you can do with steel wool. <laughs> you also need to make sure that you do this outside because the steel wool can throw off hot sparks and other elements that might set anything that's combustible nearby to it on fire. It's starting to give out. It's 